Hello, dear researchers. I hope you are doing great. So today we are going to learn how to analyze Likert scale using chi-square test and interpret the results on SPSS. So stay tuned for this video. It's going to be an ultimate way to analyze your Likert scale. Also, we have uh, some items of uh, nine points or eight points uh, Likert scale, and we need to analyze, for example, the first item. Uh, along with gender as two uh, categorical variables and because Likert scale is sometimes considered the ordinal variable but here we consider it a nominal variable for the sake of chi-square test assumptions all right so if we want to see this we are going to uh, check the first item go to analyze uh, without even having to check then just go to analyze go to descriptive statistics then we go to cross tabs all right cross tabs click on this button and then move the gender variable to the row section and move the first item or all items to the column se section all right so i can move to uh, all of them but i'm interested just in the first one and i keep it like this i'm going to go to statistics and tick uh, chi square of course we can use other types of tests here you have the choice so again i'm going to click continue and if i want uh, clustered bar, bar charts i'm going to tick this also all right and then click ok and wait for the analysis okay so here is the analysis as you can see a gender along with the uh, the the five point Likert scale as you can see here so this is the first uh, category of male and the second category of female and then you can uh, see the difference all right uh, each one along with the so the majority of male respondents are neutral all right well and the majority of them are strongly or they strongly agree all right so you can see this is the biggest number and then let's go to the chi-square test we can notice here that uh, the significance is uh, or so this is a symptomatic significance two-sided so you can see the person chi-square is 0 0.1 all right uh, so this case the the association is not statistically significant all right because this value is above 0 0.05 or 0 0.01 etc okay so this is the uh, interpretation of this uh, table you can see here the clustered bar chart concerning male and female respondents and you can see the majority of male respondents strongly agree with the item and of course you can apply this to all the items that you have in the Likert scale i'm just giving you this as just one example and if you want to ally, uh, analyze the whole Likert scale by uh, calculating the sum and everything at once in one chart in one chart you should contact me via one of my social media or whatsapp uh, facebook instagram or whatever you have you can find all the personal information down in the description box or the comment section try to contact me i am happy to uh, help you with that and if you have questions again or remarks on this uh, again contact me for this or post comments below i usually uh, respond to this uh, uh, within the shortest time possible and see you in another tutorial bye for now